Afro Beach News. Now, P square, P square, P square, Peter and Paul, Okuye, the two brothers, these guys have been doing everything, everything that you can think of, from endless rehearsals of their breakdance to endless stage practice, these guys have been putting in work to make sure that they look nice on stage. They've been doing every other thing that musicians do except from doing their primary job. The primary thing that fans asked or acts of artists generally, which is produce music or make new music. Now, P Square, if you know exactly what's going on, they've been back together or reunited for the past couple of months. Actually, right now, I can't even keep count. I don't know how long it's been. But one thing about their reunion is that they reunited, of course, as a duo, but they did not reunite in music because so far, fans have been crying Fans have been asking, fans have been seeking for music, but nothing has come out of these two brothers. And we wonder why these guys are taking so long to put out new music. They keep going out for shows, they keep shutting down um, stages, but they just are not putting out music. And like I said in my last video I did of P Square, I said somewhere in that video that P Square, they are running on reserve fuel. These guys are running on reserve energy reserve fuel from their previous run which is just not sustainable and peter okoye himself made that clear when he said that they were going to attempt to shut down the iconic o2 arena without new music with the possibility of not putting out new music and he said that because he have come to terms with the fact that P Square, they are legends. So legends can do no wrong. Legends cannot be forgotten. Now, I'm not knocking P Square down. I of course think that this guy is a certified legend. I think if there's anybody that deserves legendary status in the industry, it is P Square. But one thing that Mr. P got wrong is the fact that legends, in fact, can be forgotten. I mean, you can ask the band, obviously. I mean, the band is a legend, a bona fide legend in the industry that, you know, was popping at the same time that Peace Square was popping. Like, these guys, they rose together in the industry. Both of these guys built the industry from ground up. But where is the band right now? The band have been forgotten. Fans don't care about the band. Right now, all we know about the band is his legacy. We respect him for his legacy, but if he puts out music right now, nobody cares. People don't care about the band music. Ask Nice. Nice is somewhat considered a legend, right? But at this point, nobody cares about a Nice song. Nobody cares about Nice as a musician. We care about him being a legend, of course. We can argue about Nice or oh, Nice being a legend back in 2000 and this. He was shutting down this or he was putting out conga or something like that. But right now, nobody cares about Nice as a musician. And I feel like that have not done on P Square yet. What P Square have not realized is that if they keep delaying on putting out music, it's going to reach a point where fans will just stop caring about their music. I mean, the first week they reunited, I felt like that would have been the best time to put out music. In fact, if I was one that planned their reunion, I would have made sure that these guys were already in the studio recording before they announced to the world that they were back together right so that the first week after their reunion that initial hybrid that initial buzz the attention they gather they put out the music and the music would just blow up now however peace Square, they missed their window of opportunity that first week and they failed to put out new music now pass forward the first month passed i was like all right at least, if not the first moon, the second moon. Now, the second moon passed as well. No music. Right now, have lost count. And as time goes on, fans will go from eagerly expecting the music to be nonchalant about it. And one thing that you don't want your fan base to be, after keeping them on hold for two years straight with you guys' endless quarrels, is for them to get nonchalant at your music when you reunited and you're supposed to be excited about you guys producing new music at this point a lot of people just don't care about p square putting out music because it's beginning to look like p square just want to ride on their old wave 
and just see as much money that they could grab from being P square instead of trying to push their brand out there and trying to compete with these newer guys in the game. That's what it's beginning to look like. And as an OG fan of P square, I feel really disappointed because I know that both brothers, Peter and Paulo Kuya, these guys can take over the game again if they want to. These guys, they have it all, but things are changing, the music landscape is changing. You can't always rely on old music. Even though you have evergreen songs, no doubt about it, you just still can rely on those songs because, like I said, the landscape of music is changing, things are happening, there's a lot of newer acts coming in. You have to stay fresh, you have to keep pumping up new content. That is the only way these fans can really get back and sell it behind you. That's the only way you guys can return to number one position. Or else, at some point, honestly, P Square is going to turn into the band. Right? Nobody's going to care about their music, they're just going to consider them a legend. And in fact, it might even hurt their career if they start putting music when nobody cares because if Peace Square start putting out songs and they are no longer hits as they used to be people would say oh Peace Square have lost it Peace Square have lost what they used to be in their glory days it will look worse if Peace Square can't replicate their success from years ago so this is the right time for Peace Square to start considering putting out those songs that they've been recording if actually they've been recording but guys, share them watching about a particular situation. And guys, what do you think about P-Square reunion and the fact that they've not put out music yet? And don't forget guys to like and subscribe as well as turn on post notifications. And stay tuned for more Afrobeats related entertainment and just coming at you. I'm out for now guys. Peace.